Hello YouTube, this is Callum from English Shooting. This is just a real quick video to talk about a potential replacement for the crush nut that goes on an AR-15. Now, on the Smith & Wesson 1522 as standard, it comes with this kind of compensator and there's also a crush nut. Now what the crush nut does is it takes up the tension when you screw on the compensator and it helps keep it in place, stops it from moving without all that pressure being applied onto the barrel and it stops it from spinning and coming loose. Now while taking off the compensator for cleaning I actually lost the crush nut and just like pretty much every single gun part in the UK it's impossible to get hold of. I've been in countless different shops and I cannot get hold of one. Nobody seems to have them and some gun shops don't even know what I'm talking about when I ask for the crush nut. Now this is quite annoying because if you watch some of my videos where you can actually see the compensator and I'm shooting the video it spins no matter how tight I, I do it up and obviously I don't want to do it too tight because I could end up damaging the barrel no matter how hand tight I, I do it, it always comes loose. It always ends up spinning. And I end up halfway through a shoot having to you know, make the gun safe and tighten it up by hand. And it, you know, that's not something you want to be doing down a range or have the worry that it's gonna come loose and you know, you're know you gonna have a round hit it or it's gonna end up falling off and be, be shot or you'll end up you know, losing it because it's fallen off. So I've been searching and searching and searching and I just couldn't find a crush nut. Just, they were nowhere to be found. So one of the gun shops that I'd been in already a couple of times asking actually recommended just getting some rubber washers. Now these are just kind of plumbing supplies from B&Q. I think this pack was about two pound and it's just some mixed like rubber O-rings. Um, and I put one in and you can actually see there's one currently squashed in there. Now, I haven't used any tools. It was done up hand tight as, ha as hard as I could do it and as tight as I could do it. And I've been shooting two or three times with it now and I've probably put over a thousand rounds through the rifle and it has not moved an inch. I could take it off with my hands still. You know, I put it on with my hands, I could take it off with my hands and it's just stayed on. It has really cured the the problem and issue now i'm still after a crush nut if anybody watching this knows where i can get one and they're not absolutely extortionate please link in the description below i still want to get one because i'm effectively still missing a part of my gun but this is a good solution and if anybody else has had the same problem or somebody wants you know just a, a little bit something a little bit different or you know if you're moderator if you don't want to put the moderator against something metal and you want something to take up that tension and not damage the end of the moderator this is a brilliant solution and you know chucking a few of these in your gun bag you know they're not going to take up any space and it's just a really handy little thing to have I think there's a really good use for them as I've said for a substitution for a crush nut and to prevent damage if you're going to put a moderator on the end so I just wanted to share that because I found it an absolute godsend because now it's in place it's nice and firm it's not going anywhere and I can just focus on my shooting now so I just wanted to let you guys know so as always I hope you've enjoyed the video I hope you found it useful and I hope to see you soon